What's good, guys? If you're looking for cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure I head over my sponsor. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout for the most cheapest, most fastest, most quickest, reliable source on the internet right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back on another NBA 2K22 My Team video. And guys, today in this video, um, we just got some new moments, as you guys can see on the screen. Um, we're going to go over everything you guys need to know. We're going to go over the market. We're going to go over everything. Um, we're also going to go over... Is it worth buying these packs? Um, so that's also another one. Is it worth? We're gonna, we're gonna show you in this video. So, just wanna say this. Um, we got a moment Jalen Green. This man's cheesy. He's gotta have a crazy three month shot. I think he's gonna be one of the better players in the whole set, um, honestly. Uh, before we do get into it, sub it up, comment down below. If you guys do need MT, hit me up. I'm running mega deals on MT. If you need MT, make sure to hit me up. I'm gonna do, I got really good deals as of right now. First off, the Jalen Green Sapphire was incredible. Um, second off, he should have Cam Reddish's jump shot because he has a very similar jump shot to Cam Reddish. Look at these stats. Unreal. He's amazing on offense. Only thing is his defense isn't the best. Um, also, sub it up, comment down below. I am literally answering every single question. All right, just do that. Miles Turner, he's probably going to be an absolutely insane center. I don't understand why they only dropped like four moments cards because like a lot of players did go off. Like, I mean, Cole Anthony last night went insane. Um, he beat the Knicks single handedly. He went like 25, 12, and 8. Like, he almost dropped the triple double. He went absolutely insane. Lonzo had a triple double. And you know, I don't know. I don't know. But, anyways, this Miles Turner card is incredible. Um, he's going to be a top center for sure. I think he's going to probably be nowhere near a buyout. Like, honestly, this card is incredible. He's amazing on defense, he's lanky. He's what, seven foot? He's 6'11", and he can shoot threes. This card is an absolute G. So, if you want, I think Miles Turner is definitely gonna be one of the top centers in the game. Definitely try snapping out this card. But overall, man, these moments cards are incredible. Let's check out the Miles Bridges. He went off too. So did Dinwiddie. Um, we're gonna go over them, and maybe we can even try find a snipe builder for them. So, Miles Bridges, 6'6", six, six, power forward, small forward. Oh my God, defense, De decent defense, not amazing, but he has very good shooting stats and he obviously could dunk the ball very, very well. This guy was drafted in, I believe, 2017. Um, so, really solid card, he could even go post. So I would definitely recommend trying to kid him. Honestly, bro, moments cards bring hype to the game. They gotta continue with the moments cards because everybody loves moments and Spencer Dinwiddie, I mean, He's a beast as it was. Um, it's a great change of scenery for him. Same with Kuzma. So I definitely, definitely, definitely agree. I just I just think the defense has to be upgraded. There's like no defense in this game. Look at this Jamal Murray. It's hard to have defense in this game nowadays. There's just like no good defenders in 2K right now. So I guess they're going to do offense first, defense later. It's going to be more of an offensive game for a little bit of time right now. So... Um, yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Uh, we're gonna get into this market now. We're gonna get to the market We're gonna see if it's crash if it's not crash. We're gonna try to make some MT tomorrow We're gonna probably have prime time. I'm not the biggest fan of prime time I think that content is kind of trash. But anyways, look at this Jawan Howard, Jokic. All these players are dirt cheap. We're gonna go over them All right, Jawan Howard's a little too cheap because he could shoot the ball pretty well Even though his defense is terrible. I think he's pretty good price to buy um, let's go over to market. Let's see. Is it worth investing in? Let's see if Jawan Howard's worth investing in. So 4900 I have no MT. I have a lot of stuff to sell, though. I invested a ton. Um, Jawan Howard is honestly a pretty decent player to invest in. He's actually pretty solid. 6'9", power forward, small forward. Decent at shooting. You add a shoot to him, he's going to be game-changing. Um, I think he's more of a power forward than a small forward, though. Um, pretty decent overall. Pretty good in interior defense. Perimeter defense is decent. Let's check out his speed. 78 speed, which isn't bad as well. Jermaine O'Neal is a 75 speed at center, though. So, uh, interesting stuff. Um, I want to check out the dime filter. Haven't been on this whole weekend. I was away this weekend, so that's why I didn't get a video yesterday. I got back home Sunday late, late night. So, yeah, that's pretty much why you did not see a video yesterday. But we'll be back this week. I'm actually going away this weekend as well. I'm going to visit my boys in college. So, if you, if you still have questions, I'll still be on Twitter. I'll still be on Instagram. I'm probably just going to have a video for Friday, Saturday, possibly Sunday as well. Um, but yo, let's look at the dime filter. As you guys know, I got Lamar Odoms for around 20,000 MT. And we have the filter at around 26K. And I don't see any Lamar Odoms. So let's see what's going on. There we go. We got Lamar Odom for 30K. After that, he's all the way up to past 36,000 MT. So if you did listen to my investments, that's actually a snipe. That's a really big snipe right there. After that, it's got to be lagging. There's no way he's above 45K. Oh my god, boys, ladies and gentlemen, we have hit a massive, massive, massive 
profit margin. Oh my God. So that 30K, after that, goes up to 48,000 MT. That in my that is insane. After 48,000 MT, he's up to 60,000 MT. Guys, if you did listen to me and you invested, you are up double your MT. That, my friends, is absolutely insane. Let's check out the other guy. Uh, what was his name? Jameson, right? Antoine Jameson, that's who it is. So let's see. Oh, wow. Another one, 36,000 MT. The man was at 20,000 MT. So um, I'm not sure if I put in my auctions. All right, so I have three Lamar Odoms. Got him for around 24,000. I got Julius Randle. I got Josh Smith. I got a Chris Bosch. I also got a Gilbert Arenas. So guys, holy crap. The market went up a ton. We're going to make a lot, a lot, a lot of MT. Uh, let's check out Josh Smith. I believe I got him for around like 15,000 MT, man. I got him for really cheap. I actually kind of want to use this car because I actually do like Josh Smith a lot. He's an OG. That's, oh, uh, not Josh Smith, Josh Smith. Let's see, Josh Smith, 28,000 MT, 20,000 MT, 23,000 MT. Hey, he's actually pretty cheap. Got him for around 15,000 MT. Not gonna make the most profit of him, but hey, it's pretty solid. I'm just gonna use him for now. I believe he has a lot of more room to go up, actually, so. Chris Bosch Diamond. I got him for around 50K. I don't think I'm gonna make MT on him. We're gonna see, though. Let's see, man. Chris Bosch is pretty expensive. Hopefully. Ooh, let's go. All right, so I made a lot of MT off Chris Bosch as well. Um, Chris Bosch, 69,000 MT. I also have a shoe on mine, so yeah, about 69,000 MT. Gonna make a pretty decent amount. I'm 12 to 15K. Very, very solid. Every single card we have bought has been absolute cash. Got Julius Randle for really cheap as well, around, I think, 9K, 8K. That's definitely a snipe. And then we got Gilbert Arenas. I got him for a little bit expensive. Hopefully, he's a buyout. And Gilbert Arenas is now a buyout. Got him for around 88. Look at that. So we even have a shoe on him. I think I could clear at least 10K profit on him as well. So overall, man, I'm going to make over 100,000 MT in around, I would say, 30. So I made about, yeah, I literally made about 33% profit on all my snipes. Um, that is absolutely insane. We made out very well. Also have some of my team here. My team's not that good. We might have to upgrade a little bit, but, uh, also got Blake on a snipe. I actually threw him in my auction. Got him for really cheap too. So we're going to make lots and lots of MT and days like this is where you invest. When super packs come out, when a new season comes out is when you invest. I'm going to totally make over my team. We're going to start grinding. We might stream soon, but yo, make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter if you need MT. And, um, I'm about to make my MT right back boys. We're about to make my MT right back. So we're going to throw up these cards. We're going to throw up Lamar Odom. We're going to make some MT. Um, but yeah, that's all we got for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys invested with me, you made a lot of MT. So yeah, that's all we got for the vid. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.